weren't allowed to bring glass into the dorms. So we had to drink from this thing. Like hamsters in a cage. Except if you give a hamster a glass, we're gonna like, toss it at the other hamster. Kick Heather's heads. ass or whatever, whatever that girl's name was. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. Pretty sure it's locked. Letters to dad, they like found to dad? I don't know. Maybe she's just writing them for therapy. They're not like actually being sent. Oh, there's a list. I'm not gonna read all these because I don't know what any of these things are, but. Jesus Christ. That's a lot of drugs. That's a lot Lithium? Did any for Sparadone, I think it's like an antipsychotic. A little. None of them fix me. They Beyond her weird powers, Alex good. seems like a very resilient and mentally balanced person. Maybe yeah, for real. Safe. Guess so. Whatever the reason, the end result was prison bars. Rules. The know. only time she's Anyone been time. irrational is like explicitly due to matches. emotion magic. Yeah, other people Just fucking cause... up. Basically. Although maybe we'll find out that's like a representation of her issues or something like that. Maybe that's yeah. just externalizing that aspect of her personality. I don't know. Residents must adhere to their assigned schedule at all times and are not permitted to loiter in the dormitory outside of designated free time. Glass and silverware are to remain in the canteen. Do not bring these to the dormitory. Non-resident guests are not permitted in the dormitory. Lights out occurs at 9 p.m. every evening. No music, no TV, no screen time after lights out. Failure to, adhere to, failure to adhere to any of these rules will result in disciplinary action. Can I quibble with that just a little? I feel like when you're the resident of a dormitory, it's for loitering. You really feel like you were their property? Yeah. Right? Like, that's <laughs> where you loiter. Yeah. That's pretty true. Uh, I think these are more like return to sender. Like, yeah. Well, they're, they all got stamps. They don't have the return to sender stamps. They're just like sealed. Oh, yeah, you're right. You're right. And I thought he missed me. Hence, stupid. Guess I missed a few days. Happiness is a choice you make every day. Shit's complicated, man. Sometimes it's not just a, a letter from your daughter. Sometimes it's like having to confront the guilt over like the terrible mistakes you've made. Yeah. Hello? Well, there are my strings. Where's my guitar? I don't understand. Why can't I have my guitar? We've been over this, Alex. Your guitar stays in the rec room. You can play it during free time. That's bullshit. I don't need it in the fucking rec room. I need it when I'm stuck in the fucking dorms. Alex, that's enough. Maybe we'll just take away your guitar privileges hey, entirely hey, 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 hey. if that's what you prefer. Bro, admin, you do that. you're a dick. I need that guitar. They should have stenciled the same thing on all of us. You really feel like you were their property? Oh yeah, we already, we already have, have that I one. remember the kid who put this here. We're never getting out of this fucking place. Sweetie. Why wouldn't they like scrub that off? Something it's really good font they use with their hands. <laughs> yeah. Right. Way at first. Um. Then I no, I mean you are gonna get out of here because when they they it. turn you turn eighteen, they're gonna just make you a homeless person instead, because that's how society works. Oh yeah. Fancy. It's pretty fun. Everyone had one good outfit. We wore them to meet the parents. Yeah, that's everything. Meet the parents. That's here. a reference to the movie Meet the Parents. You already know the answer. That's pretty to that true. Question. That's what they they made us wear when they milked us. I got nipples, Greg. What's in this locker? What? What's? Why is everyone freaking out so much about it? a face in the window Ooh. no this is a weird collection i it, think oh you know. you're right Ooh. uh all right i guess i'm gonna she's been through so much yeah. i just don't know if we're prepared for a troubled girl 
Oh, I just, I'm really not in the market for a troubled one. Yeah, I want a shot that's like easy. It'll be uh, kind of like a, a Heidi style yodeler yeah. girl. What is that? I can't be a parent it'd, to a it'd, snowflake. It would be, be great if the child was like quiet at all hours. <laughs> I wonder why she's never found a home before. Well, I had a home until Gabe ruined it. I'm sure she's a sweet girl. No, no, it was a team she's effort. For us. She's awfully old, isn't she? This is the kid that's been in all those fights. Right? I want to help. I, I really do. But there's just something... Off. Broken. Wrong. With her. Did she hear this? I feel like she never heard this. It's just, just her idea of why she wasn't no i bet it's i bet it's well I, I don't know but my thought is it would be like they meet the parents right and that's what they're thinking about her as they're like oh so she's saying, like receiving like, oh, the she's nice. thoughts yeah okay yeah oh maybe she had some sort of incident at one of those meetings where someone thought something really bad <laughs> she like went nuts i think i didn't like, scream loud enough rage. to shatter all the windows Sorry. though I think that's probably it was psychic energy. Metaphorical. Why? Need to see Emotional it. particles. See what? That nobody picked me? Nobody picked you. But you've, you got your found family in Haven Springs. Nobody picked you. Nobody wanted you. Until Steph. Mom Your girlfriend died. did. You kissed. Dad left. I bailed. So you have to live. You, you can't die in his mind. It was my job to keep us. You were 11 years old. Not you your fault. Years old. You were a kid, Alex. One of the most important phrases in therapy. People leave. Life gets hard. Speaking of which, so it's not Gabe's fault at all. Sandwich. He was a child. Make it better. It's the dad's yeah. fault. Yeah. Be angry at dad. Miss Mom. It's just like in the context of him yeah. saying earlier, like, oh, I fucking hate Don't Dad. But it's like, I mean, you were no yeah, clearly you antagonizing him for a long time. It's always complicated. No one can take your yeah. life away. Fight. Don't hate your life away. Sure I... Except you for Jed. Have a gift. It's something you don't even understand. You can change the world. Get up. What? Get up and fight. Typon has to die tonight. She ain't looking good. Wow, that's a very smooth texture she found at the bottom of this mine shaft. She's lucky her glasses didn't break. Or fall off, even. Yeah. I mean, this it's absurd that she's alive, yeah. just to be absolutely clear. Like, the fact that she, we're probably gonna, like, several of her bones should be breaking. Like, the idea we're going to stand up and, like, explore this mine to find the secret of Typhon is, like, she should barely be able to move. There should be an awesome, like, uh, Tomb Raider-style triaging your injuries scene where she, like, puts a tourniquet on and breaks her bones back into place and then just stands up and walks around like normal. <laughs> At 0.75% walk speed or whatever. I was thinking uh, Metal Gear Solid 3. Is this going to be like the one match matchbook that she took from yeah, the uh, apartment? Yeah, from the from Gabe's chest. It says like just in case match. or whatever. Yeah, yeah. The one bullet to defeat Captain Barbosa with. And then she's going to find a big magic orb down here and turn into Ultron. Yeah, that's, that's the whole thing. Is like, came, how right? do you get out of this mine if what they're trying to bury wasn't supernatural, right? Like, it yeah. must be some sort of Ultron orb or whatever you Well, said. or Steph and Ryan come running in looking for you when they realize you're missing or something. Yeah. Oh, there is a but crack. How, how would they know to come to this mine, though? True. From all the places. Unless Jed's like, yeah, I just shot that. 
Yeah, man. We seen a blasting notice recently. I don't think so. Oh, you know, you know who could help? Pike. Maybe. <sighs> yeah, if he comes to mess with the mine, yeah, he he would be the only one who would have like calls to come Context. here. I feel like. Yeah. <sighs> All right. I've got to find a way out of here. The broken ladder. This will be the no trick. More ladder. Not that I'd be much good at climbing. Yeah, we're not going to be moving too fast here. That tracks. Tracks? Like the they mine track? A... Yeah, exactly. They did a shitty job of blowing up this mountain to hide their secret. And because I'm very much in this mine right now. Mm -hmm. It's very well, not I think blown they... up. They're just trying to blow up like the entrances, right? To make sure people get it, can't get in, and oh, they haven't maybe. finished yet, obviously. Maybe. You can't interact with that toolbox? There's got to be something good There's there. a toolbox? Yeah. No. Or a lunch pail or something. That's I, fucked I up. Cannot. Is there something... Like, I feel like that book is readable, even. I no prompt. No, no, well, no. With a prompt, like I feel like if you look at it, it might you might be able to make out what it's supposed to say, but maybe uh, I'm crazy. No, it's like... Ink blot test or something. It looks like a phone right book, <laughs> honestly. I could almost laugh. Safety first. It wouldn't hurt so much. I have to tunnel my way out. How long has this stuff been down here? Three, four years. Sloth is gonna be dig down here digging a tunnel. That's what they're a gonna really, about. really big cavern. Yeah. I don't know, I've never been in a mine. That's probably normal. They're probably big. I've been in a mine. Really? Was it big like this? It was fucking huge, dude. What is that sound? Oh, it's gas leak or no. something. No, 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 no. Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> is, is she like, gonna evolve her power or something? It's... You're in a pitch black mine. Extremely wounded. It's going to be hard to do this. You could probably find your way back to the room that had the beam of light from the ceiling, but... Do you have control right now? I don't know. I wasn't pressing anything. No, it's cutscene mode. She's finding the magic orb. Okay. That's something. She's perceiving the Earth's emotions, and the Earth is angry due Earth to global is so warming. so pissed. Quit blowing me up, you fuckers, says the Earth. She's gonna absorb the anger from the Earth, and then she's gonna go, the Earth is healing. Is the only lead I've got. That is a strong, malicious energy coming from further in this mine, though, man. Yep. You can see it from here. Oh my god. Oh yeah, there's some, some magic shit going on. Yeah. Max is gonna show this is the, like, boys, close. Yeah, exactly. Held the evil the anomaly project. that ends the world from the first game. So deep, we see where the devil sleeps. I was gonna say God Daniel, but right. I, I knew you would know who that is, so. Is Daniel Tosh from Tosh.0? Oh? Daniel. I don't know the last Daniel name. Tiger from that children's show? What? Daniel from Life is Strange 2. No oh, what's his He's, deal? No. He has telekinesis. Or telekinesis? Before. That's what I meant. We finished oh, okay. the job. It'd be a much more useful power for this situation than Max's, I feel like, but. Then Max's? You just Steady. rewind time and go to the top of the mine. Grow up. <laughs> Max's power was broken good. Time control is ridiculously correct. Oh, is this like gas distortion, basically? We gotta move oh. now. There's still men back there. They'll drown. They'll drown. They'll drown. Yeah, and so will we if we don't get the fuck out. Make the call, Jed. Huh. God damn it! God damn it! Everyone, let's go. I mean, so is that what it is? They just abandoned a bunch of people. <laughs> they didn't rescue everyone. Is that all it is? It smells like fireworks. Well, that was already it's clear from the context. Charges. Yeah. It's just like, what are they trying to hide? If that's all it is, though. I mean, I don't know. Oh no, they're. I think they're trying to hide something else.
Wow, I was right about the orb. <laughs> Let's ponder, gonna that ponder the shit out of this thing. Oh yeah. Wow, they tried to hide it, huh? So they blew up the mine, and then it all it did was push it uh, to the very edge of the rubble to easily find. What the? What? And it's such evil energy radiating off of it. God. New memory unlocked. Where the devil sleeps. So they're they're trying to cover up that their dad was down here and got killed. Oh, she's getting the negative emotions of the dead people now. Dad, come back! Dad, you son of a bitch! What? Jen, you gotta stop, man. Jen! Fuck you, Jen! Come back! It's over, Jen. He's not coming back. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. So it really is just they let other people die. That's their covering up by killing someone else. I don't think it will. I don't think they That's... covered up so those people died. Man, I'm confused, man. I wonder if Jed, like, adopted Gabe because of guilt about Chen dying or something. <laughs> and then he went on to try and kill me out of guilt. <laughs> the, the, the fact that, like, more, like, I guess this is implying that more people died than they said, but I don't understand how that could possibly be the case. Yeah, it's really weird. Yeah, that was gonna be blood. Yeah. Fuck you, Jed. Dickhead. It's also like the idea of being like it's like we need to cover up that more people died in the mine than we initially said by knowing that there were other people that might get caught in the blast if we blow open the other mountain, right? It's such and a weird, like, covering up by killing other people is nonsense. Yeah. I've come to realize what makes Haven so special. It's a flower shop run by multiple generations. A bar owner who greets every... Oh, man, Alex is going to walk in. <laughs> yeah. It's a spring festival tradition going back a hundred years. History, loyalty, pride. Fuck this down. These values which define Haven are the same values that Typhon was built on. And that is why our partnership has been so successful. Yeah, what do, what do Ryan and Seth think happened to Alex? It's been my privilege. They're, they're just wondering where she is. That was commitment to Haven. Yeah. a knowing look of like, have you heard we from her yet? Leave in this community and we're tremendously excited for its future. This lady uh, is scum. Thank you, Ooh, that gun above the door. I think I speak for all of us <laughs> yeah. when I say we're eager to make this official. So, Ooh, that pickaxe above Jed said. And then lunch. <laughs> Didn't start without me, did you? He's like, uh-oh. <laughs> Jed spends the pull out a gun. I will kill everyone in this bar. Cover up my secret. Oh my god, I'm fine. You are not fine. We have to get you to a doctor. What happened to you? Jed, just say Jed's name, please. Say it immediately. Uh, this will be hard to hear. I found out something you need to hear. I'm sorry. What? Is Ryan Jed's son? Yeah. You're hurt. Okay. Yes. Do you need help? We can call an ambulance. Typhon's been lying to all of you. <sighs> Jed's no here. Whole town of eight Jed people. <laughs> yeah. Alex, what's going on? <laughs> Come back. Fuck you. Fuck you. 
I'll say it again what too. What the hell happened? He shot me in the head. In the say that. Night. I saw what Typhon's been hiding for 12 years. I was in the mines because Jed, Jed shot me. That whole story is a lie. You should be like Pike, you Jed should be grabbing Jed's gun for gunpowder residue or whatever. Seven of his men. He let them drown to save himself. There were pictures of me and Gabe down there in the dirt. Because one of those miners was my father. I think that's really kind of contrived to be like the Not though, father. because he Typhoon felt guilty and adopted up. Gabe. And then I mean, she came to see Gabe. It kind of makes sense, yeah, actually. Yeah, you're right. Yeah, you're, yeah, that's actually a good point. You're, you might be of all the writing in the game, it's, it's. I think that's like a little elegant, almost. More money. They'll do whatever it takes to push this expansion through. So they decided to. Like, please him just him. say that and Jed shot you, though. To stop that blast. Not even the fact that there were four people up in the mountains. Yeah, you got to get that point out. That's how Gabe was killed. Jed knew all along. He covered up the truth about the past, about Gabe. And when I found out... Okay, there we go, there we go. It. He tried to kill me, too. Why is the cop sitting there? Why aren't <laughs> any of you saying anything? Do they all know or something? We don't want to embarrass you, Alex. What? Are they just going to try and gaslight her? I wasn't asking you. The things you've said obligate me to at least address them. Kiss my ass, lady. I kill her. I really? fight her right now. Like, uh... And trying to go into the mine was... Obviously, a very dangerous, very illegal thing to do. But we all it, well, interject about that. You didn't go it's into the mine. So much. Yeah, Jed literally oh, shot me, punched. dude. Family, wasn't he? She's going too close to Alex. She's getting punched. How much you want an explanation for his loss? Something to give you comfort and renegade interrupt. Make your life seem less unfair. You suppress the evidence. You know you there's proof freak. of the cover up. You had Pike arrest me to suppress the evidence. Officer Pike arrested you for stealing items from my purse. Perhaps you were looking for evidence? And it I was bugging your computer. Which is why you and Jed tried to threaten me into silence. Dad? You really need to get to the shooting. Do you have any idea for real. what Alex is talking like, about? Like, open with that. No. I don't. Yeah, MF shot me. I tried to be there for Alex since Gabe died. I thought, I don't know. I hoped I could be something of a father figure to her. All I can guess is, sometimes when we're hurting, the people we lash out at are the ones who are trying to help. No better way to help than to a bullet to the head. You're a monster. Fuck you. You tried to kill me. How can you stand there and say these things? Alex. You're a monster. And I don't like you. Please. I know this is hard to accept. You all trust him. I did too. But I'm telling the truth. I believe you. Well, yeah, you would. Of course I do. Yeah, it's almost not even relevant. She looks like a shot. Look at the frame of the shot. The... Oh damn. No, they're not going to resort to like killing someone in this room. I would like to speak. I agree with that, but the the, the angle on that looks so it's like he's about to drop heat rocks. Very, very long time. And uh, Miss Jen, Alex, I'm realizing. Yeah, the, hey, Ducky. You as well uh, as blow me, motherfucker. You are so much braver and more courageous. Made, given your oh, no. <laughs> He's a moron. The resultant confusion. Lucky, I'll refer but you back to figure A. Blow me. It saddens me to hear you make these 
terrible and incredible accusations against my friend. Ducky. You know what, I realized it makes some sense that they never got in touch with their dad since he was dead at the bottom of a mine for a long time, huh? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> it makes sense. You're a bad person. You know our mind can play tricks on us. None of it is your fault. Bro, Eleanor, suck my dick. Refer back to figure it's A. It's so hard to admit you need help. But it's always better in the end. We're all worried about you. Let us help you. Yeah, dude, this is this is a good a good scene. This would definitely Try piss players it. off. It's working. No. Leave me alone. I don't want any more of this. I wonder if she would help us if I didn't cure her. Yeah, maybe she'd be super pissed. Yeah. What are you trying to do? Take down Typhon? Yeah, if she if she could harness her rage right now Dude. and unleash a, a blood oh, art. Everything These people are not registering that this guy shot you in the head. I mean, Frida look at her, dude. But she needs to say that's what I'm happened. They probably think okay. she just fell going into a mine. Charlotte is broken now, though. Yeah. We, we did fuck up Charlotte forever, so Sorry. that's something. You emotional vampired her. And now How she's about undead. Pike, though? Pike at least might help. Don't worry, Alex. I got this. Oh, for Did he look at the USB drive? Have a USB stick full yeah! of Yeah. Yes. Holy we shit. We went through this yesterday. Your superiors closed the case. None of us have time for conspiracies. Yeah. I'm going to turn the weasel way out of uh, I wonder all these right? reaction shots of Ryan are like I know your game. I know because I didn't kiss him, he's mad at me or something and doesn't <laughs> You know what? Doesn't take my side. I'm not I don't know. I feel like he would be massively conflicted. Yeah, you? Not Typhon. Right. No matter what. Deputy Pike, do you have some kind of personal issue with me? Like hell I do. Jason. Well, given that your judgment in this matter is emotionally compromised, you should probably remove oh, yourself from cut the crap. If you think you could shut me up, leave it. I think you better call the cops. It, it's weird that it seemed like curing Pike was the good thing, but curing Charlie like broke her fundamentally. That's that's a weird to me, but I don't know if that's necessarily a good thing. Maybe he could have been more effective. Yeah, I don't know. If he was fearful in a different way. Or I could even sign the document to be like, see, they tried to science me by making me sign by making me sign this, so like it might have been like evidence against yeah, them in a yeah. way. My dad is not a murderer. Well, too bad. He did shoot me. Were you afraid we couldn't get Typhon? Is that why you need someone else to blame? Your dad we shot together. me. For Gabe. Ryan. No. I'm not going to let you do that to me anymore. Ryan, what the hell? I know he's your dad, but look at her. Why would she lie about this? It's going too far. I was okay with taking on Typhon, but accusing my dad of anything? Hell no. Yeah. Fuck you, Ryan. After everything? Seriously, fuck you. Stop. What? What the hell is happening? Oh my god, you just ascended. You're about to make Jed confess. Somehow. Yeah, let's blast him. I know why you tried to kill me. It's not what you tell yourself. That you thought it was. Best Couldn't bear for you to see him. himself in front of this was never whatever his face is all, that way. This was about you. Yeah, it was his selfishness of being a hero. I know it's easy. Everyone in town liking him. Not having to think about the guilt. Yeah. Heard. You want to look away and pretend the people you hurt aren't people. But I won't let you. Get his ass. My father worked for you. His name was John. 
He was a fighter. It's a screw up. The world never gave him anything for free. Well, I'm trying to make I'm trying to make Jed feel bad. He fought for us. Maybe he was finally winning. Dude, you killed him. You killed him. And then Gabe, my big brother. He was happy, dude. You know, you killed when him we too. Were kids, we goofed around to escape, to pretend everything was better for a little while. When I got to Haven, the first thing we did was dance around like total dorks. And it I wasn't an that. escape from anything. He was happy for the first time in his life. But he died. Because of you. And then there's me. For so many years, I just wanted to survive, to get through. Haven changed me. I started to think about the future. I want to belong. I want to belong somewhere. I want to know that there's a place and a group of people who wouldn't be the same without me. I was starting to feel that here. And you tried to murder me. You would have ended my life just so you wouldn't have to face the truth. Oh. You've forgotten it, haven't you? You've plastered the purple glow in our eyes. eyes. Story. Yeah. You tell yourself you're a hero. He's actually the demon king from the underworld, or a whatever. Strong leader. I hope you still have all those scrolls. Sometimes that means <laughs> making hard choices. Decisions that could lead to people dying. Few men could handle that. Haven's lucky to have you. But that's the lie. If you scrape it away, what do we see? You're selfish. Eleven years ago, you led a group of men to their deaths. And you were too selfish to say those words out loud. There was so much to lose. The love of your wife. The respect of your son. The comfort and ease you had walking around the world. All of that mattered more to you than those men's lives. I can feel you trying to pull away. Don't. You're in my mental realm now, Jed. Sometimes it's so awful. Pretty anime. You're gonna break. But when you come out the other side, and you're whole and free and still alive, then you'll finally know how strong you really are. see the truth about you. You hate yourself. Go for the jugular. You hate what you did in the past. Go for the killing blow. You hate what you've done to keep it secret. And the more you deny that I wonder hatred, if like she's saying this out loud or if this is like a, just a psychic attack she's doing. Uh, yeah. <laughs> you are I've seen the worst parts of you I 
condemn you. Fuck you, bro. And I condemn Forgive? You. Hell no. I do not forgive. I do not have oh, mercy. <laughs> also, by the way, your son, uh, suck my dick. Prefer to figure Jump A, also. blow me. <laughs> Steph, we're getting the fuck out of here. Fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck you. I will be texting all of you middle of finger emojis after this session ends. So please look forward to checking your inbox.